Go harvest. Get the most out of your S700 series combine today. Before beginning any procedure, follow safety instructions. Understand all safety decals according to the operator manual and always wear seat belts. The following video will focus on familiarizing yourself with the functionality of the S700 series combine command center. The John Deere Combine Command Center houses the armrest, multifunction lever, and Generation 4 display. Each component has a functionality similar to the previous S600 series combine. However, some improvements have been made to enhance the customer experience and harvest productivity. Beginning with the armrest, you will see a similar layout to previous John Deere combines, starting with the auto header height control and reel speed dials for front end equipment. In the center are the header and separator engage switches. Now to the left are the three engine speed buttons, followed by the transport lockout, propulsion and park brake buttons below. Moving to the right, you will see the controls for the beacon lights, hazard lights and field lights with the entertainment and HVAC buttons below that. Next at the top right is the armrest encoder dial. Following that, you will see the settings control that allow adjustment for concave clearance, rotor speed, cleaning fan speed, chaffer clearance, sieve clearance, and residue. Underneath the settings control are a set of reconfigurable buttons that the operator may customize as desired. And lastly, you will find there are a set of lock buttons that allow access to reconfigurable button functionality. The lock button on the right is for the armrest reconfigurable buttons and the lock button on the left is for the multifunction control lever reconfigurable buttons. The S700 multifunction control lever provides an ergonomic shape with reconfigurable buttons. Functions facing the operator on this lever include the quick stop switch, auger swing, auger engage, reconfigurable button, auto track resume, header raise lower and tilt switch, reel raise lower and fore aft switch, as well as the header activation buttons. Located on the back side of this lever are four more reconfigurable buttons with a reconfigurable scroll encoder below. Attached to the armrest is the 10-inch Generation 4 touchscreen display with navigation bar below. Buttons on the navigation bar allow the operator quick access to combine applications. A status bar can be found at the top of each page and shortcut keys at the bottom providing easy access to commonly used applications and functions. Combines come equipped with four default run pages including settings, harvesting, work monitor, and performance. All applications may be accessed through the menu key located at the bottom right of the display. The applications are configured into three different tabs including machine settings, applications, and system. The machine settings tab includes apps for common combine adjustments such as calibrations, harvest settings, and header adjustments. Also found in the Machine Setting tab is Controls Setup, which provides the ability to assign functions and assignments to reconfigurable buttons on the multifunction handle and armrest. To assign a function, choose either the multifunction handle or armrest followed by selecting the desired button location and assignment. In the Applications tab, you will see Precision Ag Apps as well as automation features. Another item in this tab is Help. It provides detailed information about systems and applications. Select the application for which you desire more information. Also within this tab is Layout Manager, which allows the operator to create their own custom run pages and modify the shortcut keys. To create a custom run page, Select All Run Pages and the Add New icon at the bottom. Simply name the page and add desired models accordingly. To modify the shortcut bar, select Shortcut Bars and Default Shortcut Bar. Next, select the shortcut key you would like to remove and tap on Add a Shortcut Key, followed by the desired application. Finally, the System tab houses apps that allow you to configure and change the settings within the display. To return to the Run Pages, close out of the menu by selecting the X in the upper right corner. Dual display and monitor capabilities are available. Available accessory power is provided in the armrest via USB and power outlet as well as a power strip outlet beside the seat. 
please note that machine configuration and optionality may be different by machine. This video is intended to be a quick reference for the Gen 4 Command Center on the S700 series combines. For further and more detailed instructions, please consult the Operator's Manual or contact your John Deere dealer.